everybody, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm going to be doing a haul. So most of this I bought with my Christmas money that I got. Um, we went sales shopping, so a lot of this is from the sales, which is super exciting because everyone loves sales, like come on. But yeah, without further ado, let's get on with the video. So I went to multiple different shops and I ordered stuff. There is one thing actually that I picked up right before Christmas, like literally like two days before, um, which I thought I would show you first. So this I actually picked up from Superdrug. I was in need of a new lip gloss because I'd actually left mine at Zara's, which was so annoying, and lip gloss is my favourite thing. Um, and the one I picked up is the L'Oreal Dazzle in 210 Disco Ball. And I was going to get like a, not a glittery one, but I really liked this and it was so cool. Um, and I actually really love this, it goes really well with like orangey eye looks, it just looks really nice and glowy. So I would say, if you can't really see it, it's down here, it's like a little, it's kind of bronzy, gold shimmer. Um, and I love lip gloss because it's just more moisturising and I love it, so I think this was like... 6.99, 99 I'm not sure, one of the two. Um, but yeah, this was one product I picked up. Let's go with my next order. So I ordered off of the next website some sports gear that I wanted for ages and they're actually the Nike Pro leggings. Um, by the way, sorry I'm not doing a try on haul, I just don't have time to do that at the moment. So this is what the waistband looks like, they just say Nike Pro and then on the left leg there's the Nike swoosh and then around like the back, kind of the side, it's got this kind of material that's holy. I don't know how to describe it, uh, but they're really nice. I think, I don't think it's, oh, it is slightly see-through, but not much. <laughs> um, and I got mine in, what size? I got mine in an extra small. Um, I wasn't sure by the next guideline, so I just went onto the Nike website and looked at the size, guys, size guide on there. These are really good. They looked really short, and I was like, oh no, like, this is not going to fit me. Um, but I put them on, they stretch, and they're like a full length on me. They stay up around the waist. They're ones that you don't have to keep pulling up, which is really good, because with a lot of different sports leggings, you have to, like, constantly be pulling them up, because they just don't stay. Um, but yeah, these are really good, and they actually stay up, and and I think these were, I'm gonna say like £32 or something, I will check and I will put it here. So worth it and I love them and they're so comfy. So the next thing I ordered was Calvin Klein and this was something that basically, so some of my friends had been like, come on you need to get some. So in the end I caved and I was like, yeah okay I'll get some. Um, I got them in the sale, I think each pair was £8 and 5p each. I'm pretty sure. I don't know whether this is weird to show you, but I'm going to show you it anyway. So, firstly, I got uh, this colour thing. Yeah, I'm not going to go into too much detail. Um, I then got some this colour, like just normal, and then I also got the matching thong to go with that. Um, I have worn that already, which is why I don't have it it's in the wash. But yeah, I really like them. They're really comfy, and I'm kind of glad they were on sale by so much because. I don't, I don't see the point in spending full price on them because, to me, I would just rather go buy Primark pants, but they're a nice little luxury to have, if you get me. And they came in such a cool box, I didn't know what it was, it was like a brown box, and then I opened it up and it was like Calvin Klein, and it had a little envelope, and it had tissue paper and everything, it was just so cool. Um, but yeah, there's me fangirling over Calvin Klein packaging, but hey, it was really cute. Um, the next thing I ordered was ASOS, so there were multiple different things I ordered from there. First of all, in the sale, I ordered a pack of two, I think they were crew neck t-shirts. I got them in, what size? I got them in a six, um, and it was just a pack of two, white and grey, so this is what they look like. They're literally just plain t-shirts. The sleeves are quite short, so this is the white one, as you can see it's quite long. Um, I've already worn the grey one, it looks like this. Um, I bought these because I feel like basic t-shirts are something that like everybody needs. So I bought these, I wore the grey one and I tied it up at the front. I feel like those kind of, these tops are perfect for that. Tying up at the front, just tucking into like a pair of jeans. Um, so I'm really glad I bought them. That was £4 something um, for the two. So I think it was just... I knew I wanted something like that, so that is why I picked them up. So also off of ASOS, I ordered from Jack Wills, because the thing I love about ASOS is that they have like all the cheap stuff, but then they also sell some like nicer brands. <laughs> God, don't do that! That scared the life out of me! Shut the door! It wasn't shut before. Yo, can you shut it? 
Oh, Gracie! So, um, I actually picked up this Jack Wills sports bra. So this was on sale, or was it on sale? I don't know if it was on sale, I can't remember. I will have a look and see. Um, but basically, so the front, it looks like this. It says Jack Wills along the bottom. Um, it's got, it's black. <laughs> um, but then the back of it, it's like racer back, and it's all like mesh. So it looks really, really nice on, and it's also got the bottom strap, which is like a bra strap. So um, it has the like clasps and stuff, which is really useful because then you can kind of adjust it a bit more. So I got this in a, a size 6. Um, there was a size 4, but I knew the 4 was probably going to be a bit small and I knew the 8 would be too big. Uh, which is why I got the 6, and it fits really nicely. So yeah, that's what I got. I can't remember how much it is again, but you will have seen it on screen. The next two things I also got off of uh, ASOS, but like via Jack Wills. So I picked up this bralette which was on sale it's not like a padded one or anything um it looks so tiny um so it's just this like burgundy i don't know what you call it like patchwork kind of thing and it's just got these straps but then on the back it's like all lace all of this is lace so it's like normal at the front cute on the back so yeah that's the like what the back looks like um and then the little band at the bottom says Jack Wills on it. I'm pretty sure I got this for £7 something, down from 20 I think. So I was like, yes, such a good deal. And this looks really nice, just under kind of baggy jumpers, that kind of thing, because the strap shows. Um, and then I also got, I don't know again if this is weird, but I'm showing it anyway, um, matching underwear to get. You have to buy them separately, um, but they just look like this. So again, they're normal on the front, but then they're like pretty on the back. I actually got this in an 8, I got the bralette in a 6. Um, and they were also the same price, but they were down, I think, from a little bit cheaper. The last thing that I actually ordered off of ASOS were a pair of shoes. And um, I'd never heard of these brands before. I originally wanted to get some Vans, but the ones I wanted were out of stock. And I really wanted to get some of these shoes, but I actually really like these. And they're a bit different, like, they're not a, a brand like Vans, so everybody has them if you get me. Life's a joke, you're broke. You love laughs the away. The shoes I got are these. They are by the brand Diodora, which my dad said like was quite well known when he was younger. Um, but they just look like this. They're grey. Um, I can't remember what ones they're called, but they're like the original ones, I think. But they're really nice. So they are like soft grey. That's how I can describe it. Uh, the white bit is just like normal, and then the tongue is white. I got these in a size five and a half. I'm so glad I didn't order the five or the six because they would have been like too big and too small. So this is like literally the perfect size. And I really, really like these. Uh, they're just really comfy. Like they are so comfortable um, and they go really nicely with jeans. So I think these will be sh some shoes that I wear a lot. And these I think were 27 pounds down from 60. So I think that was such a good deal. I like I was going to buy Vans for 65 pounds and I got these for 27, which I like just as much. So all of the other things I actually brought bought when we went out shopping. So uh, the first thing that I picked up was from Primark. So I got another pair of shoes. Um I wanted another pair of shoes because I saw these and uh they were so comfy and I really really liked them. So they are this like a pinky kind of colour and they're a dupe for, I can't remember what they're called, but they're some like Adidas shoes because you can tell because of this here, like the Adidas shoes they have it here and here I think, um, but I love this colour, they're like really really nice, um, they just look like this, they're comfy, yeah, and so, funny story, so the label said these were £12 and when I got to the till they were like £5, I was like, what? Like, it didn't say it was in the sale or anything, so I was really happy with that. I mean, I got these for a fiver, and I really like them. I've worn them twice already. Um, they're really comfy. Look, I just think they're so nice. Like, why spend 60 quid on shoes when you can get them for a fiver from Primark that are just as nice? Like, I'm sorry, but yeah. So, um, I was really happy with these, especially that I got them for, like, such a good price. I was like, oh yeah. So, the next thing I got from Primark... It's a bit wet because it's, I've just taken it out of the washing basket and it's been drying on my radiator. So I went to Primark and I tried on a few things, but not that many. I couldn't find a lot I liked. Um, but then I love their like jumper, sweatshirt things. So what I picked up is this red one. If you like follow me on Snapchat, probably, or my vlog channel, you may have seen this already. So 
it's red. I really like the colour red on me. I think it suits me. I don't know why. I think it's because of my blue eyes. Like, the colours kind of go quite well together. Um, but it just says, too cute to care. Um, I literally wore this about five days running because it's so comfortable. Um, it's really, really nice. It's really fluffy inside. So, there was literally like two size 16s and like three 12s so I tried on the 12 anyway because it didn't it doesn't look too big like I'm not gonna lie it doesn't look massive well it looks quite big but not like loads I tried it on and it was fine I was like well I'm gonna get it then because I like it and it's comfy so I it looks really it looks fine like tucked into jeans you can wear it a bit more casual and it looks quite cool but then it's just also really good for just like lounging about because it's really like it's quite oversized it's cozy um, and this was only £5 from Primark, so I think that was a really good price. Next thing um, I picked up was another clothing item. So this was from New Look, and I didn't think I found anything New Look. Like, there wasn't a lot again. But I saw this. It's this denim jacket. I wanted one of these for ages with, like, the fur on top. So this is just the... I got this in a size 8. There was a kids one which had fur inside but it was £10 more I was like mm, no thank you um, so I tried this one on and I really really like it and what I also like about it is I can take off the fur so like during summertime because it's it's like quite it's quite cropped I would say um, and it's authentic denim which is good but um, I really liked it because I love the colour and the wash also the fur and the fact it's detachable but the buttons are really nice so I was like yes I'm gonna go get it and another thing with this so I thought it was £20 and then I got to the till and they said it was 10 and I was like, oh my god, like this day is going so good. I was so happy. I was like, yes, like this makes me want to buy it even more. So again, it didn't have like anything written on the label, so I was really excited about that. And I have worn this a couple times already. I didn't think I would because it's quite cold, but I love this so much. I actually wore this with the grey top. Um, it looks really nice all together, not gonna lie. <laughs> so the next thing I bought, which actually only arrived yesterday <laughs> when you're watching this, the first thing is the Revlon Colorstay Foundation. I, what I really like about this foundation is you can get one for combination to oily skin, but also I think normal to dry, which I think is really good for a foundation because yeah, it's good. But I have had this already, so I could order it online. Um, and this is in the shade Buff 150. Um, I love this foundation. It's the one I have on right now. It is literally the perfect shade. Tip there. Can't remember how much this is. I think it's like ten pounds, but I'm not sure. Um, I then picked up another thing, which is an update, and it's the Maybelline Brow Satin in Dark Blonde. Um, if you've never seen my videos before, I love this. So it has like a little pencil here, which I love because it's kind of like a really good consistency but then it also has a little sponge and the lid is full of like I think it's powder or something um, but then you also use this to fill this in if you want I don't use it that often I personally prefer the pencil but once the pencil runs out it's good to use it because it's just easy um, and I'm pretty sure this is 6 99 and then I also picked up something which I haven't had for like a year because it ran out and I like just didn't rebuy it um, but it is the Maybelline Lash Sensational I picked it up just in the normal black I didn't want the waterproof or anything um, and I was so glad I did because I forgot how much I loved it. I have it on right now. Um, so I was just really happy I bought this. I think this is $7.99, but I'm not sure. It might be $8.99. So, yeah, those things are so, I'm so happy with. But then the last thing I bought was one of my more expensive purchases. So um, I really wanted a card holder because I find a lot of the time, now I've got my pin back, like I can actually remember it and use my card, um, it's easier to just bring my card than like my whole purse so if I'm just like like the other day we just nipped into town I just had my coat but I didn't want to bring a bag so I had to try and fit my purse in like my my tiny little coat pockets and it just wasn't ideal so I was looking out for a card holder we went into John Lewis and I saw this and this is a Ted Baker card holder I've never bought anything from Ted Baker um, but I saw this and I was like, oh, that's nice. So the front is all this like pastel, it's like patent pastel pink, which I really like. I think it's a... Oh. Um, I think it's really pretty. So I liked that. The back has this little gap for a card, but I personally wouldn't put it in the back just in case it gets stolen. I just get scared of that. Um, but then it opens up and it's this really pretty kind of fuchsia, I guess pink um which i really like so and it says ted baker london i think this is for like a bus pass or a something so this might be useful next year for me um but then i've just got in here because i don't have that many cards yet i don't need a lot i just have my like debit card uh 
can't get it out. My Super Drug Health and Beauty card. That's like one my second most used card. Um, and then I also have my boots card. So they all fit in because there are three slots there. So, um, but this is just so useful and I can just put it in my coat pocket when I'm going out. So that is just really useful. And so originally this was £30 and then it said on the tag like £21 on sale. I was like, oh, that's really good. Get to the till and they were like, oh, it's 18 I was like... So like three things I bought in that day were even cheaper than I expected so I was like going around and I was like god I still have money left like how is this going but yeah I really like this this is actually one of my favourite purchases because it's something that will be really useful and I can keep this for ages because it's Ted Baker. That is it for this video I really hope you enjoyed it I know um, it's a haul but I, hey I mean I love hauls personally but I have my mocks next week and as soon as this is finished recording I need to go do some revision because I am behind on revision and I need to go do some um but yeah I really hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below press the notification bell as well so you get notified every time I upload a new video uh but yes I will see you all soon and I love you lots bye